the scenario we're covering today is when you sell um, multiple items to a client and the client decides um, for some reason to return uh, one or some of the items back to you. How do you deal with that from inventory side and from invoicing side of it? So I'm going to run through the scenario from start to end so you can see um, how it's going to work. So first of all, we create an invoice for a client in our demo company. We um, pick a um, client, um, ABC furniture, uh, we invoice them. And from our items, we pick an item, we pick a black t-shirt, medium black. And we, um, we have four on hand, so we sell them, let's say three and approve. So we created the invoice, the warehouse uh, will send them um, three of these t-shirts and um, the client decide um, that they don't want one of the t-shirts that uh, they ordered. Um, and there would be two scenario now, either the t-shirt comes back to our warehouse and we can put it in our stock or the t-shirt comes back to us and um, it's right off because of a faulty. Um, so I'm going to go through both of them. So the first step is the same. So for either of the scenarios, we have to uh, create a credit note. So we add a credit note to this invoice. One of the items is back. So we say one. And as you can see, credited um, $40, which was the price of one um, t-shirt. And we approved that. So in the first scenario where um, the t-shirt has just came back and gone back to the stock, that's easy because now we're done. Because what the credit knows, uh, note does at the same time is add that inventory item back to our uh, stock. So if I go to um, our inventory management, have a look at the medium black, you would be able to see that we had four and we sold three and one that came back. So at the moment we have two in hand. So that's easy. So for the first scenario that uh, it's coming back to the stock, we're done. The second scenario was the item coming back to us, uh, but it's faulty. We have to write it off. So in order to do that, we go to options, new adjustments, where we have to make adjustment. We say uh, one, item so now stock on hand is one and you have to have an adjustment um, inventory adjustment account so we post that inventory adjustment and review that adjustment or oh, we have to have an explanation here we say um, hole in the shirt for example and we post the adjustment now, if you have a look at it, uh, you can see um, that the credit note is there. And then we've done an adjustment here, minus one. And as you can see, the quantity on hand is, um, is one now. Um, and it's all um, posted to the account. So on your account is uh, recorded that you write off uh, one item. Um, if you have any questions like this uh, about zero tax, you can um, go to wiseadvice.co.nz and ask us any question that you want and we'll create a video and put it online in our channel. Thank you.